The fallout from an explosive investigative report by seven days on a culture of sexual assault and harassment at Vermont's only prison for women continues tonight as an open community forum about the Chittenden Regional Correctional Facility was held in Burlington. Local 22's Devin Bates was there this evening. He joins us now from the newsroom with the latest. Hi, Devin. Well, Glenn, Chittenden County State's Attorney Sarah George, who said she was furious about the findings of the report, was in attendance, as well as Commissioner of the Department of Corrections, Mike Touchette. Dozens of Vermonters also weighed in and made it clear that the community wants immediate change. Members of the community came to Tuesday's forum on claims of sexual misconduct and drug use at the Chittenden Regional Correctional Facility looking for answers, with some directing their frustration toward the Commissioner of the Department of Corrections, Mike Touchette. We're talking about people who could be being raped tonight. We're not talking about, I mean, that's your work. And that's really great to get us together for two hours. But, you know, we, this is not, this is not going to happen in this manner. This is your job. Touchette was one of four panelists at Monday's forum, along with representatives from the ACLU of Vermont, the Department of Human Services, and the Vermont Network Domestic and Sexual Violence Coalition. Ashley Messier with the ACLU of Vermont was once incarcerated at the facility and said she's spoken with inmates that have been screaming about these issues for a long time, and like many, called for immediate change. Touchette, who said he's considered resigning, now believes he can be a part of that. My moral compass is true. The vision that I have, I think, aligns with where we need to be. I'm committed to that. I still have the energy and I still have the enthusiasm. Touchette said he expects immediate change, but said specifics are tough to describe. He wants an outside party with expertise to help evaluate the situation. Other panelists had a clear vision of what they'd like to see going forward. The first line is creating support for these women right now, yesterday, today, last week. Uh, the second thing is to create safe spaces for women to, to report uh, misconduct that they need to report and experiences that they've had. And not only uh, how they are able to report it, but who they're able to report it. Sources in the Seven Days article allege that complaints against prison staff are often ignored by leadership and guards who raise concerns are punished. Chittenden County State's Attorney Sarah George said that could be an area where her office steps in. Those cases need to come to us in order for us to know about them and that wasn't always happening. So I think that if we change that process of how we get involved, then maybe it would change how many cases are brought. Now we also got an update tonight from the Vermont Agency of Human Services on the investigation into this. They've been in talks with the U.S. Attorney's Office to see if they can conduct it, and if not, they'll look for another outside entity to do that work. Live in the newsroom, Devin Bates, Local 22 News.